WNBC TV, New York. The following program is brought to you in living color on NBC. It's time for What's This Song? And here's the star of the show, Wynn Martindale. Thank you very much. That's enough. That's enough. Thank you. Thank you. And good morning, everybody. What's this song? Maria. Beautiful song from a beautiful Broadway production, West Side Story. It starred the equally beautiful... Miss Carol Lawrence. Hi, Carol. Hello. 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 Maria. I just met a girl named Maria. That's lovely. Better than it was actually done in the play, right? Well, as good as. Well, almost. I don't. <laughs> Carol, <laughs> welcome is. to What's This Song. Thank you. Gee, it's nice to have you with us today. Nice to be here. Look forward to a full week of programs with you. Thank you. Now, what's this song? Although it's a little past Christmas, that was the Christmas song. And here is the talented young man who wrote that beautiful song, plus many more, Mr. Mel Torme. Hi, Mel. Good morning to you. Good morning. Well, I think all of you will agree we have a great team of stars with us today. And Mel, welcome to What's This Song. Nice to be on with you, Wins. Thank you. Nice to have you here all week long. We're right in the middle of a game, by the way. And let's meet our players for today's What's This Song. First, with Carol Lawrence on her team with 20 points and one loss and $220. Let's say hello to Lee Willis, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Lee, welcome back. <laughs> now, playing as Mel Torme's partner with minus 20 points today, one loss, $700, and a round trip is Margaret Wayne. Margaret, welcome back. Good luck to you. We'll be back to finish this game in just a moment. But first, wouldn't you be interested if somebody told you how to save time and work? Well, then, just watch. There's no shine like a Simonized shine on your car, on your floor, on your furniture. And today, it's the easiest shine to get with wonderful new Simonized products like Tone for furniture and Vista, the one-step cleaner wax for floors. In fact, with Vista, you can go from a dirty floor to a Simonized shine in 14 minutes. Vista combines cleaner and ammonia with Simonized floor wax. Just spread on the dirty floor. Vista picks up all the dirt, then dries to a self-polishing Simonized shine. New Vista One-Step Cleaner Wax takes you from a dirty floor to a Simonized shine in 14 minutes. And for a Simonized shine on furniture, just dust with new formula tone. Tone's True Spray Nozzle aims a light, even mist right where you want it. Tone cleans and shines your furniture while you just dust. Remember, there's no shine like a Simonized shine. Get Tone for your furniture, Vista One Step for your floor. All right, everybody knows how to play the game. You get 20 points for a correct song title, 20 more points if you sing the first two lines of the chorus exactly as they appear in the sheet music. The score, 20 to minus 20. And the first team, by the way, to 100 wins. Lee, it's your turn to identify. So what's this song? All right, Lee Willis, what's the name of that song for 20 points? I can't think of it. All right, let's go to the other side. Mel Torme and Margaret Wayne. You can identify that one or go on to the next one. What do you want to do? Be honest with me, dear. Be honest with me. With Be me. honest with me. me. Be honest well, what, with can me. I accept? All right, we'll accept that. Be honest with me is a correct title. Be honest with me, dear. Margaret Wayne, it'll be up to you to sing the first two lines of the chorus. If you do so correctly, you pick up 20 points. You're incorrect. Ready, Margaret? Be honest with me, dear, whatever you do. If you really love me, be honest and true. All right. Carol Lawrence and Lee Willis, over to you. If you think those lyrics were wrong, you have the right to challenge. If you challenge and sing the lyrics correctly, you pick up 20 points. If you're wrong with your challenge, you lose 20 points. I think we accept it, don't we? Yes, we certainly do. You're going to accept? Yeah. Yeah. Well, they were incorrect with the lyric. Actually, it's be honest with me, dear, whatever you do. Remember your mind, dear, so always be true. Uh -huh. 
That's the oh. way she reads. However, you didn't challenge, so you don't lose anything. You have 20 points, and uh, you picked up 20 over here. So we're even. So you're all even we're at all double even. zero. All right, Carol Lawrence, what's this song? <laughs> all right. Pretty song. pretty song. What is it, Carol? The very thought of you. That is correct for 20 points, and you're up to 40. All right, Lee Willis, your turn to sing, Lee. The very thought of you. Okay, Lee. The very thought of you, and I forget to do the little ordinary things that everyone ought to do. All right, let's see if we have an agreement over here on those lyrics. Mel, Margaret, what do you say? Can't fight him. Can't fight him. You can't fight him. You can't fight him. No, sir, that's exactly right. Very, very nicely done, Lee. So the score is 60 to nothing. However, Mel Torme is going to do something about that right now. Mel, what's this song? Let's see. All right, Mel, I have to have the exact title. What is it? The music goes round and round. That is correct. So you've got 20 points now. A little consultation on these lyrics. It'll be yours, Margaret. Yours to sing. <laughs> All right, Margaret. Okay, let's go to Carol Lawrence and Lee Willis. And do you accept or challenge? We'll accept it. You're going to accept that one? Well, it was incorrect again. Why? Uh, the exact lyric is, rather than oh, you blow through here, it's simply I blow through here, no and, just the, the music, music goes, goes round and round. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> and it comes up here. So what, what happens here? to us now? The here was right at the end. Comes up here. Comes up here, right. And it That's comes it. up here? Yes comes up here. Holy cow. <laughs> <laughs> but I thought the whoa, whoa, whoa's were just great, didn't you? Yes, that was right. And they were right, by the way. They're being snide with, but it's all right. <laughs> all right, 20 to 60. Let's go back to the other side. Lee, what's this song? Sixty points over here on this team. Let's see if you pick up twenty more with the title of the song. What is it, Lee? You turned the tables on me. Correct. You're up to eighty. Quite. All right, Carol. Oh, dear. <laughs> you, you turned the tables on me. And left me crying again. You turned the tables on me. Let's go over here, Margaret and Mel. Such a feeling of accomplishment here. How about that? No, they take that. We're challenging. you. <laughs> please, please, please. The bell hasn't sounded. <laughs> the bell hasn't sounded yet. What do you challenge or accept? We challenge. All right, who's going to sing this one? Mel. I'll sing it. Margaret says you sing. You turn the tables on me. And now I'm falling for you. You turn the tables on me. I can't believe that it's true. That is right. A correct challenge for 20 points. <laughs> <laughs> so the score, the score is 80 to 40. You take a breather. I think you look like you were a little nervous on that one, and he really came through in the clutch. We'll be back in a few moments with more of Watch This Song. But first, what's been happening to old Preem? Watch. Oh, up, up. Heave ho! Over! Heave ho! Ha ha! Let it drop! It's going beautifully, Captain. Yeah, Phil. But why are we throwing away old Preem? Why are we throwing away old Preem? Why are we throwing away old Preem? I'm glad you asked. All right, fellas, move it over. Look alive. All right, over, over. Let it go!
Now, where was I? Oh, yes. We're throwing away all the old preem because new preem makes coffee taste so much better. New preem is all new, completely changed, absolutely different. It tastes better than cream. It's got a rich, full, fresh flavor. Delicious? Delicious! Now you know why we're throwing away the old preem. New preem tastes better than cream. <laughs> I'd like to take just a moment here to send along our congratula sincere congratulations to WFLA-TV, Channel 8 in Tampa, St. Petersburg, Florida. I'd like to wish them many, many more happy returns on this, their 10th anniversary. <laughs> now, the score is 80 to 40. And Margaret, you're still very much in this game. What's this song? Right, Margaret Wayne for 20 points. What is it? Back in your own backyard. That is correct. Yeah. Back in your own backyard. Detect a little English accent there. You're right. All right, Mel. You can tie it up. The bird with feathers of blue is waiting for you. Back in your own backyard. You oh, <laughs> so, uh, that, you know you start listening and you really get the feeling. Gee, I'd love to hear him do that all the way through. Yeah. So if you get that one of these feeling times, again, Mel, you go when this show is elongated to an hour, we'll do it. <laughs> okay. Carol and Lee. Now, what do you say? Challenge or accept? We accept. We it. accept. That. You're smart because he was exactly right. Very good. Game tied up. Eighty to eighty. However. Carol, you and Lee sort of have the upper hand now because with the identification of this song, you win the game. All right, Carol, it's yours to identify. Oh dear. Carol, for the game, for your partner, Lee Willis, what is it? There, I've said it again. You are right. The game's over. <laughs> but it was close. It came from minus 20. That's you certainly right. did. That was very good. I Thank think they you. deserve some applause for coming from minus 20 to tie it up. All right, that means you just won the game, Lee, and $100. And in a moment, the chance to play our minute medley. So stand this by. Margaret, I'm sorry to say that was your second loss. However, you didn't do badly on What's This Song. You won $700. We have a gift from Hamilton Beach for you. And our sincere thanks for being with us on What's This Song. Margaret Wayne from Sherman Oaks, California. And the best of luck to you. Now, for the Minute Medley, during the next 60 seconds, Lee, you have a chance to win $200 and a round-trip plane ticket to any city in the 50 states or in North America. This is how the Minute Medley works. Bobby Hammock is prepared to play 10 songs. We pay you $20 for each correct title you name, Lee, $200 in the trip if you get all 10 exactly right. If you don't know a song, press the buzzer there, and we'll skip on to the next tune. Now, Carol, you can help him with the titles, but he has to uh, say them out loud for right. me. Right. As a clue, all titles in this Minute Medley will begin with the letter R. All right, Bobby, song number one, please. Ramona, that is right. Row, row, row. Correct, number three. Rain, that's right. Rock and chair, right, number five. Spring, Spring Diamond Rockies. No, number six. Go to the next one? No. All right, next song. Route 66. Right, number eight. Round and round. Right, number nine. Rose of Washington Square. And number 10. Roman and Gloman. That's right, they got in under the wire for $160. Lee, out of the ten songs played, you missed number five. He's going to kill yourself with this. Red River Valley is the old song. Oh. Number six. Now, this one was Red Sails in the Sunset. Oh, God. Oh, However, yeah. you picked up $160 in the Minute Medley, $100 for winning the game. That takes your total on What's This Song, Lee Willis. You have $480.
Now then, Lee, for our second game, if you will, come over and join as your teammate, uh, Mel Torme. And Steve Dunn, who is our new contestant, please? From Hollywood, California, a very pleasant good morning to Nora Cohen. Hi, Nora. <laughs> Nora, good morning to you, and welcome to What's This Song? Thank you. Best of luck to both of you, Nora and Lee. You know how we play? You know the rules? The first team that correctly identifies the opening song starts our new game. So ready with the buzzer? Bobby, next song, please. All right, Lee Willis, what is it? Gallon Calico. Gallon Calico. Gallon Calico? I, th that is... That's correct. Is that Gallon Calico. Right, all right, that is acceptable. <laughs> all right, Mel Torme. I'll never be able to get through the week. <laughs> First two lines of the chorus. All right. About a gallon Calico Down in Santa Fe Used to be her Sunday boat Till she went away All right, over to the uh, other side. Carol and Nora. We don't challenge that. All we right, you, you could have challenged because it was incorrect in a couple of words. Met a gal in Calico down in Santa Fe. Used to be her Sunday boat till I rode away. That's Oh, well, it's just that I rode away. It's your fault. You left. The gal that I knew rode away. <laughs> Shows you my luck. You got out of that pretty good. Though. All right, 20 to nothing. Over to the other team now. And Nora, your first chance to identify. What's this song? Nora, what's the name of that song? Uh, lucky Old Son. No, let's go to the other side. Mel Torme and Lee Willis. That Lucky Old Son. That is correct for 20 points. That Lucky Old Son. Lee, it's yours to sing. First two lines of the chorus is what we need. Okay, Lee. Up in the morning, out on the job, Work like the devil for my pay, but that lucky old son gives me no, has, has nothing, nothing to do but roll around heaven all day. We're gonna team up, folks. Now, on your last line, I want to ask you. You said, "But that lucky old son has." Has nothing. nothing to do. All right, let's go to the other side. Carol and Nora, do you challenge or accept? No challenge. And they were exactly right on the lyrics of that lucky old son. Since you changed it there just in time. All right, 60 points for them, and we'll be back in a few moments with more of What's This Song. But first, what's it like to hear a dog's thoughts spoken out loud? Well, look and listen. Training time again, old puppy. <laughs> Roll over. Very good. Here's a meat flavor snack for you. <laughs> Come on now, jump. Whoa, terrific. Here's a liver flavor snack. Oh, watch the finger. Play dead. Good boy. Here's a cheese flavor snack. Now sing. Come on. Oh, come on, sing. Beautiful. That's about C sharp. Because you're such an affectionate, wonderful bow wow, here's an entire box of new milk bone flavor snacks. They look like bones and they chew like bones. Oh, easy, easy. Over a hundred delicious biscuits in six flavors meat, milk, liver, vegetable, bone, and cheese. They give you energy. They're a tasty appetizer, and flavor snacks make a dog adore you. Oh, flavor snackos. Today we're playing What's This Song with Carol Lawrence and Mel Torme. Travel arrangements on What's This Song are made by TWA. You fly an economy star stream jet via TWA Trans World Airlines. TWA is the airline showing movies in flight on most nonstop transcontinental and transatlantic flights. Runner-ups on today's program will receive from Hamilton Beach a liquid blender and an electric knife, the only one with a hole in the handle and designed to fit the hand. Both appliances from Hamilton Beach Division of Scoville Manufacturing Company. We'll be back in a few moments with more of What's This Song, but first, here's the cooking secret that uh, wakes up natural food flavors, accent. <sighs> How's this? Oh, well, now. <laughs> well, I, uh, no. Uh, <clears throat> oh, my goodness. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> 
accent. Wakes up flavor nature puts in food. Oh, well. <laughs> Jumples and salads, too. And not to mention Irish meal. Listen to Accent and wake up all the flavor nature puts in food. Flavor you'll never taste any other way. Sounds indispensable, doesn't it? All right, our score at this point, 60 to nothing. However, Carol, it's your turn to identify. So all what's right. this song? so pretty. What is it? Stars fell in Alabama. That is correct. <laughs> We're trying to make everybody in Alabama happy. This Nora will make people of Alabama very happy, I'm sure, if she sings this exactly right. First two lines of the chorus. Nora? Ready? Stars fell on Alabama The night That, that you held me tight Yes, stars Stars fell on Alabama. Nice try. Nice. <laughs> Dixie. <laughs> What's everybody laughing about? I thought that was pretty. Didn't you? <laughs> I think Swell. she has a lovely voice. Well, yeah. All right. Lee and uh, Mel, what do you say? Challenge or accept? I think we'll challenge. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Who's going to say All right, I'll say it. All right. Mel Torme. We lived our little drama. We kissed. In a field of white And stars fell on Alabama Last night That is right! I gotta tell you, I gotta tell you, I like their lyrics though. I think they did a marvelous a swell job lyric. of improvisation. <laughs> The score is 80 to 20. And we'll be back in a few moments with more of What's This Song. But first of all, Coughs of colds can sure cause a lot of problems. To listen to some good advice from Vicks. <coughs> Mommy! <coughs> Here I am, honey. When coughs of colds wake her, how comforting to have you there so fast. With Vicks cough syrup, improved with Silentium, the modern cough silencer, effective as codeine, even better. It's not narcotic. Silentium works in her cough center. Here we are. Quiets her cough gently. It tastes like cherries. Soothes your throat, too. Works hour after hour. Ideal for children down to age two. Effective for all the family. Vicks cough syrup. And to calm heavier coughs of colds and flu, get Vicks Formula 44 Extra Strength Cough Mixture. Contains Silentium, too. Buy both. They're from Vicks. Well, we are just about out of, t as uh, Margaret Wayne would say a while ago, we are just about out of time. Yes, I think or as Carol was. Lawrence would yes. say. Oh. However, the score at our point of leaving you this morning is 80 to 20. We'll all be back tomorrow, same time, to continue the game. And a special word of thanks to lovely Carol Lawrence and to Mr. Mel Torme. Look forward to seeing you again tomorrow. Win Martindale saying bye for today. See you tomorrow on What's This Song? Goodbye. What's This Song? This is Stuart Phelps, Jack Reeves, Jesse Martin Production. Now stay tuned for five minutes of the latest news, followed by Concentration, next on NBC. Produced in color in association with the NBC Television Network.